So as I'm making up my bed, I'm trying to figure out what I want to wear. I pretty much got a couple pieces picked out. Black pants, my Baltimore City College hat, my Baltimore City College Nike hoodie, and for the tennis shoes, the more up-tempo Nikes. I decide this is what I'm going to wear for my photo shoot. Let's put it on. On my way to the school, I was just sitting and reflecting on memories from when I went to city. I reflected on how the scenery changed around in the area, and how the people are now compared to what they were back in the day, and different stuff like that. As the cab driver turned on to the Alameda and I got to see the castle from afar, a lot of memories about the school and my time at the school hit me. A lot of the lessons I picked up, not only academic but just life in general behind these school walls, they still stick with me to this day. From 2001 to 2005 is when I attended Baltimore City College and those years were very uh, poignant in my life because it had me, it, I just grew up during this time. It's just, it just my first time actually had to really depend on myself to do things. Attending City basically helped promote my creative side. I first learned and started doing beats here when I was, you know, into making hip hop and R&B beats real heavy into production. This is also the first place I learned how to edit videos, believe it or not. The teachers had an invested interest in helping the students progress and higher learning here. I can really sit here and say that, you know, City prepared me to go to college because a lot of the academics that I learned from here, a lot of the classmates I had in college didn't have those tools. I was just thankful that I was able to go to a school that provided those things to me so early so I would be accustomed to them when I had to uh, do it in college. Despite the photo shoot being a good idea, I figured I probably could have picked it on a little bit of a better day. As a motherfucker out here, God damn. But anyway, so I'm waiting for the photographer to come and snap some shots. Unfortunately, I'm probably not gonna be able to get most of the shots that I wanted or I was envisioning in my head. Cause you got this big ass chain link. Boy, can't get to the bleachers, nothing. But I'm gonna make it do what it do. I'm gonna make it work out or whatever. Man. Shit crazy, man. I put a little dag on the shoot, but I work it out somehow. Still got fly pics for y'all, so I holler at y'all after the photographer coming. All right. Due to the wind, you couldn't hear me too good. But basically, I wanted to introduce y'all to my photographer, Zaya. Make sure y'all hit up Zaya on Instagram at one blue vision or go to her website bluevisions.com. Baltimore City College High School, aka the Castle on the Hill. Despite the weather, we was able to get some great shots of me standing on the steps by the tennis court in the back corner of the school. We even got some good shots right in the front of the school near the parking lot. After the photo shoot, I told Zaya that I had planned to go get something to eat, and she decided to join me because she was hungry too. What ensued was usual car talk. And we got a whole big ass. Why do cool? See the view in the fall just because of the orange? Well, yeah, orange and blue. It's fall right now, ain't it? Uh, yes, it is. I'm just saying. Even if we did one. Yeah, it's you fall, know what? Got yeah. Leaves and everything. I'm just saying for color. But no, more than always, especially in springtime. As long as all the leaves are in foliage and stuff like that, yeah. the yard looks really nice. Man, I had to my almost side swipe me on the way up here. What? Yeah. Oh, hell no. Nah. It's, it's weird, because like, 
all those artists that were like really pumping mm -hmm. from yeah. when we were cool, like they're still current, like they still do stuff, but they just don't have to push like they used to. Like, like uh, uh, I always had a juice, man. What happened to that guy? Uh, yeah, what happened to that guy? Everybody was going to For that, damn, uh, damn prices be high as shit. They be charging you steroid wing prices for the damn, from little ass baby wings. You getting a party wings and you ordered a, a five wing chicken box. It's crazy. Oh, no. What's going on, Jimmy John? Oh, the Jimmy John's is, uh, high as hell. Oh, all right, yeah. Remember, I was telling you about that when he's down at the ballpark? Mm-hmm. How's that? Gotta get you some love in here as you eat your food. I ain't gonna record you eating, bro. What do I want? Neo Soul? No. Oh, 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 oh. Some trap music? Yes. <laughs> All right, basically, we destroyed our mail. I, de I demolished mine. I had a whole $5 box. <laughs> I don't know what she had, but she just took it, took it to the head, took it to the head, took it to the. <laughs> <laughs> and you see the mess I got on the table here. What's funny is they got these 1990s Taco Bell tables still in this location. I don't know what's going on here, but they need to update for real. <laughs> I mean, they got the little chairs that you sit and spin. This this place is not made for a heavy set guy like myself. You know what I'm saying? It's not. I, I, I can barely look at this. I can barely squeeze up in this damn thing. Damn! Thank God for losing a little bit of weight. <laughs> Thank you for watching TJ the DJ TV. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can keep up with your boy.